looks like we should put him on the payroll. Not bad, little brother. Oh, imagine what we could do if we tried, huh? Hey, you guys are hot. Where'd you guys learn to dance like that? That was good. <laughs> I don't know. We've been doing it since we were little. We used to watch those Fred Astaire and Ginger Rogers movies, you know, and update the routines a bit. Whatever you guys do, you knock them out tonight. Thanks for your moral support. Listen, I've got to run, but let me know how it turns out, okay? All right. You too, huh? Can I walk you to your car? No, thanks. Uh, good night, everyone, and good luck to you guys. Good night. Good night. You leave so soon, Kelly? Yeah. I'll see you on the polo field. Well, congratulations. When can you start? You mean it? I never say or do anything I don't mean. Yeah! <laughs> I mean, what he means is thank you, and you can start any time. Great. Maybe we should go into the office and discuss terms. I'll handle all that later. I'm sure you'll find you'll be more than adequately compensated. My name is Gretchen. Just so we understand each other, this club is my baby, and I run it my way. Having said that, you should also know that I like working very closely with most of my employees. I like to see my people happy. Yeah, just one big, happy family. I don't believe we've met. I'm Rick. Rick is Steve. I'm a friend of Tawny's. Really? The taste is improving, Tawny. He's a man. Excuse me, Mrs. Richards, but uh, we'll have to hustle if we're going to make it to the airport on time. All right, just bring the car around and I'll be right there. Well, nice to have met you all. Thanks again for the jobs. We won't let you down. I'm counting on that. Love. Now, did I just hear right, Tony? I I heard him call her Mrs. Richards. I didn't realize your brother was married. He's not. The bitch is married to my father. <laughs>